The dangers of belly fat most people do not know. Belly fat, also known as visceral fat, wraps around a person's abdominal organs, such as the liver, intestines, and pancreas. The increased fat in these areas can interfere with their regular functions. Belly fat is metabolically active and has been linked with a number of health conditions. High visceral fat sends a toxic stream of chemicals into the body, which leads to inflammation. Excess belly fat can also lead to high blood pressure and blood sugar levels. In addition, it also hikes triglycerides and lowers good cholesterol. A recent study of over 15,000 people showed that people with high levels of belly fat are more susceptible to cardiovascular heart disease. Excess visceral fat also makes a person prone to develop insulin resistance, which in turn can lead to type 2 diabetes. The risk of cancer is also raised when a person has high levels of abdominal fat. A study showed that chances of getting colorectal cancer nearly doubled. Among postmenopausal women who accumulate visceral belly fat, a study linked both total body fat and abdominal fat to a raised risk of breast cancer. When the women in the study lost weight, around 6 kg, 12 pounds on average, changes in biomarkers for breast cancer indicated a reduction in breast cancer risk. Unhealthy amounts of visceral fat can also shrink the brain and increase the risk of dementia and Alzheimer's. Risk of developing dementia increases up to three times more in people with high amounts of abdominal obesity compared to those with less abdominal fat. Controlling your overall caloric intake can help reduce body fat and the risks associated with it. Eating all natural fruits and vegetables which were placed on the earth by our creator will always be the best source of nutrition for our bodies. Only add things to your food that you know will not cause harm to your body. We advise everyone to avoid prepackaged and processed foods. But if you have absolutely no choice, then always look at the ingredients carefully and how many calories the product contains. If you do not know what an ingredient in your food is, then do not consume it. Artificial sweeteners like aspartame have not only been linked to fat gain, but even more serious health conditions, such as cancer, strokes, depression, anxiety, severe headaches, and multiple sclerosis. Most of the artificial sweeteners found in food products today are very harmful, especially to children. So we advise consumption of natural ingredients only. Remember, your body has rights over you, and it is your responsibility to take care of your body. If you are a parent, then this responsibility is even greater, as your children rely on you to make the decisions for them. Stress is also another factor that can contribute to weight gain. The body's stress hormone, cortisol, is positively correlated with visceral fat gain. So, better stress management habits, such as the daily prayers and meditation, can also contribute to lower abdominal fat. A study found that people who slept five hours or less are also more prone to weight gain. So, try to get at least seven hours of sleep to stay healthy. For those who have already gained visceral fat, high-intensity exercise has been proven to significantly lower belly fat levels, along with a balanced, healthy diet. Ooh.